Dealing with COPD by Adam Kummer, Rowan Altahir, Leanna Crawford. About to go to the doctor. I'm so tired, but I need to get ready for my doctor appointment. <laughs> Yummy breakfast. Just going to the doctor for a checkup. I have been waiting in line for 30 minutes. Hurry up. Sir, could you please calm down? We will get to you as soon as possible. Hello, Mr. Smith. What seems to be the problem today? Well, doctor, I have a cough that won't go away, and when I cough, it has a lot of mucus. Also, when I walk, I get short of breath very quickly and I feel a tightness in my chest. Well, Mr. Smith, sounds like to me that you might have COPD. COPD, what is that? What does that even mean? COPD stands for Chronic Obstructive Pulmonary Disease. The five most common causes are smoking, secondhand smoke, pollution, inherited or if you have asthma. So doctor, who is at risk for this COPD? The people that are most at risk for COPD are smokers, people that have a family history, preterm babies, people with asthma, and also people that live in bigger cities. Well I do live in a bigger city, also I used to smoke, and I do have a family history of COPD. Most people don't experience any symptoms until the later stages of the disease. So, what are some symptoms of COPD? Symptoms of COPD are shortness of breath, wheezing, lack of energy, blue lips, and unintended weight loss. How is COPD diagnosed? We can diagnose it by doing a CT scan. Is this going to hurt? How long is this going to take? No, it is a non-invasive test and it is painless. It only takes about 30 minutes. Okay, that sounds good. Now what should we do? We will go back to the room and talk about how to prevent it, treat it, and the prognosis. It's too late for me to try and prevent it now. You can prevent COPD by not smoking, or if you do smoke stop as soon as possible, also by moving to a smaller city, and by making sure you treat your asthma if you have it. Okay, I will definitely quit smoking and I will think about possibly moving to the country to get away from all of the pollution in the city. What are some ways to treat COPD? You can treat COPD by trying to quit smoking, medication, lungs therapies, managing exacerbation, and sometimes surgery. What kind of changes can I expect? You will have difficulty breathing and shortness of breath during exercising. There is no cure for COPD, but I can give you some medications that can help you breathe easier. We could also give you a bronchodilator to help with your breathing. Okay. Well that's depressing. I'm going to go home now and I will take care of myself. I just need to go by the grocery store and the pharmacy on my way home. Just need to pick up some groceries and my meds. I got my groceries and my meds. Just need to check out now. How are you doing today, sir? Not so good. Just came from the doctor's office and he said I have COPD. It's such a nice day out. I think I will go by the park on my way home. This weather sure is nice, but I am getting a little short of breath, so I should head home. Finally, back home after a long day. So glad to be home after a rough day. I should get ready for bed. I am really getting tired now. This time magazine has some good information about how to deal with COPD. Time to get up and I need to make sure I take my meds for my COPD. It's going to be a nice day I should go outside and get some fresh air. 
I think I should go for a walk. Hope I don't get short of breath again because of my COPD.